The uh, stool gift for 1993, the hard health stool gift is being introduced to the crowd here, making their way down towards the start very quickly. The field, the red Dean Capabianco from scratch, Josh Kuhl, five and a quarter, Craig Ferber, seven metres, Jason Richardson, seven and a half, he's the favourite. Tony Martin, eight and three quarters, and uh, Malcolm McDowell off nine and a half. A big round of applause for Dean Capabianco as he makes his way down the track. Well, Capabianco is certainly the crowd favourite. You know, can he do it off scratch? That's the big question, Michael. Well, Chris, realistically, for him to win, he's got to run better than 12-1 electric. Now, that that's, that's constitutes of a run of somewhere near 12 metres inside even time. But that hasn't been done before. Mm. Well, Revelo Manitoba ran here off, it ran 12 hand handheld, which which is equal to 11 a quarter. So, you know, that, that's what he's got to overcome. That uh, Revelo Manitoba ran 8 to 0, 100 meter Olympic final in Mexico. So he's got to be in better uh, in in better shape than that. But this man's confidence must be sky high, and I would you could never discount him. He will be coming over the top of these fellows at the end. I mean, what's he got to lose? If, oh, only the store gift. But I mean, that, uh, good point. <laughs> he's, uh, in, ter in terms of the fact that he can, he's just a competitor. He's just going to chase. He's a great athlete. He's giving away, you know, nine and a half meters. He's a big occasion runner. Look at that. He's Did they often running. do that? Wipe their face down? Yes. Oh. He's just First cooling himself. I've ever seen do it. Oh, just cooling himself down. Yeah. Probably had a little bit of perspiration coming up the track. Mm. In his warm up, he wants to make sure that he's 100% prepared. There's Josh Cool, 23 year old Josh more noted for his 400 meter uh, efforts but this is the first time that he's really started to show something up the center he was um, a very convincing winner in his uh, semi-final but he really needs to, to find that little bit off the blocks to have claims in this he will be running home at the end but i don't know if he's got that necessary early speed in the first 50 chris well he's got to get on to craig ferber he's got to give one and three quarter meters to craig ferber 20 years old great effort by craig ferber and he's been running around place in the last three gifts and has now won himself into the store gift he'll give a good account of himself he's got to give a half a meter start to the man in the yellow the raging gift favorite michael jason richardson well there's an air of confidence about this fellow i like the way that he sort of strutted down there he sort of believes he can win he won the bill howard here at stall last year so nerves aren't going to upset this fellow he knows what it's like to win a race at stall but he's got to chase the man up in the green, Anthony Martin, 27-year-old. And uh, Martin was very impressive on Saturday. He was a little bit tight, a little bit nervous in his semi-final. And I think that uh, he'll run a bit better in there having that, got that one out the road. Yes, uh, start of Boone Chapman going through the orders for the starters. It's up to you, he says, boys. Don't break, you'll lose a metre. Mark McDowell, nine and a half metres. They've got to chase him, Michael. And uh, he's going to run 12. He's going to run somewhere around 12. They're going to have to run that to beat him. Mark McDowell is a great competitor. As I said, it's going to be a race in three. Really looks to be the pink. Out of the pink and the yellow. And watch out for that red. Storm and home. Well, you saw the on. interview with McDowell. He was very, very keen. He said, they've got to beat me, he said. But we'll soon know. They're set, ready to go for the 1993 Hard Health Stool Gift. They settle down now. Bianco sitting up a little bit in the blocks. Ben Chapman has them. This is the big one. The one we've come for. Set! And away they go. Papa Bianco away well. Cool quickly in the stride with Ferber. Richardson then coming Martin McDool. He's a great go. The yellow's in front. It's Richardson hoeing the way. Coming at him again. McDowell. Richardson in front. Richardson beat McDowell. And third aim then would have been Josh Cool. Uh, then the Dean Papa Bianco who couldn't do it from Tony Martin. Well, Jason oh. Richardson has won the store gift in emphatic fashion. A great training effort by Graham Goldsworthy. That's his first store gift winner. You know, Jason's overcome stress fractures in his feet to win the 1993 store list of gift. He's run a sensational 11.94. And you can see uh, Jason's in there somewhere. Capa Bianca is congratulating him. And here's the final, Michael. Get away. Look at uh, Richardson. He's got alongside uh, the green jacket straight away. They've gone straight to Mark McDowell. He's asserted his authority on the race straight away. Martin's falling behind. McDowell's really struggling to keep with Richardson at the 100, and he's cruising through. And he is so happy. He's had a quick look out the corner of his eye. He's won by three quarters of a metre and a great run. <laughs> oh. Uh, must be very pleased. Oh, it's the ultimate. Woo! You've done Just it. can't believe it. Thank you for the gift. Dreamed about it for about a year. Wanting to uh, emulate John Dynam winning the Bill Howard one year. Gift the next. I just can't believe it. Stable turtle, mate. <laughs> <laughs> the boys are happy. He is a legend. <laughs>
my God, I'm out here. Where did you get the nickname Steamboat? Steamboat. Oh, I don't want to joke. No, no. That's my colour. That boy is all we want. Uh, Yellow, well done. You're going down in history now, Dave. Eleven point nine four for the Stalgate winner, Jason Richardson, back after this break. Get into those two boys. Get into those boys.